Happy New Year and welcome to the 2009 Spring Video Newsletter. My name is Dr. Lisa Alistway from the Department of Health and Human Performance at the University of Houston. I would like to share with you some exciting happenings taking place this semester. First is the arrival of Dr. Jian Liu. He comes to us from Virginia Tech with a research background in occupational biomechanics. He will be teaching courses in biomechanics in the department. We also welcome the arrival of Ms. Martha Hayes, who is our new communications coordinator and who will be working to raise the awareness and visibility of the department's achievements and opportunities. On another note, Dr. Clark has been elected by his faculty peers to serve as the President-elect of the Faculty Senate during 2009 and President of the Faculty Senate during 2010. Another piece of exciting news for the department is that we have a new Masters of Science Nutrition degree with two emphasis options, one in Sports Nutrition and the other one in Nutrition Science. Don't forget to mark your calendars. The Texas Obesity Research Center will be hosting its inaugural conference April 9th and 10th. It will be held at the U of H Rockwell Pavilion in the MD Anderson Library. Scientists, educators, clinicians, and community leaders are all invited to attend this innovative conference. Conference proceedings will include various panel discussions, as well as featuring a keynote speaker, Dr. James Solis. For more information about the TORC conference and how to submit an abstract and register, please visit the following website. Dr. Phyllis Gingas, Director of the Health Network for Evaluation and Training Systems, reports that the Texas Legislature will be considering bills for a smoke-free Texas. Her network is actively involved in this. The number of cities that are smoke-free in Texas and the percentage of our state population living in those cities has grown dramatically since the last session two years ago. Her ordinance database is providing legislatures information they need to learn about the swelling number of citizens supporting local smoke-free laws. The goal is to transfer them statewide so all Texans can be protected from secondhand smoke. Finally, the Laboratory of Integrated Physiology's Motor Control and Biomechanics Research Group has moved their equipment and operations to a new facility within the National Center for Human Performance at the Texas Medical Center. Doctors Adam Thrasher, Jian Liu, Bill Pulaski, and Chuck Lane are enthusiastic about the possibilities afforded by the spacious environment, proximity to clinical research colleagues, and accessibility by patients participating in their research protocols. An open house showcasing their new facilities and capabilities will be scheduled later this semester. Thanks for checking out our HHP 2009 video newsletter. I hope you have an awesome spring.